Hello friends, welcome back to CAD practice. Today we are going to construct a 3D model of V-Belt pulley in Autodesk Inventor software. So let's get started with today's tutorial. Go to new, take a standard part in millimeter and go to create. Now take the 2D sketch and select this XY plane. Now, we will first make a center line, go to line command and from here make a line, skip, give it a dimension, the dimension of this line will be 55 mm, ok, skip, now select this line and make it a construction geometry and make it a center ok so from here to here the dimension will be 55 by 2 ok now we will construct the pulley profile so go to line command from here make a line profile here ok this will be a rough profile and this and this will be the last ok now you can make this also escape select this profile and make it a construction geometry now go to dimensions from here to this point this will be of 10 okay now as you can see the center line which we have constructed has moved so go to coincident select the center point and select this line okay now this is a fixed profile now go to dimensions once again and give from this point to this point the height will be 109 and the height the total height from bottom will be 127 mm and from bottom this height will be of 22.5 ok now we will give the horizontal dimensions from here to here this will be 25 by 2 ok and the bottom will be 55 by 2 this center line is also moving so select this center line go to coincident select this center line and select this center point ok escape now go to dimensions this line and this line will be 15 by 2 ok ok this is fully defined profile now go to line command once again from here make this profile like here this is the v cut and go to dimensions this dimension will be 9.5 by 2 and this dimension will be 15 by 2 okay this dimension from center line will be 29 by 2 ok now this is a fully constrained profile now we will go to mirror and select this whole profile select this line ok now go to mirror line and select this center line apply done 
now you can see the final sketch okay now go to finish sketch and go to revolve it will ask you the axis the axis will be this center axis and okay now we will make this cut profile change it to right view this cut profile for that go to home now go to 2d sketch from here select the yz plane and change the view go to view from here change the view to wireframe okay now go to sketch and select this circle from this center point make a circle of dia 190 and one dia is 64 okay and now go to line command from here to this dia we will construct a line escape and we will make a straight line from this point to the center point okay this point is line is moving so go to coincident select this point and select the center point now this is constrained select this line make it a construction geometry similarly select this line make it construction geometry now this is not constrained so go to dimension select this line in this and give a angle of 29 degree okay now go to line command from here to this 64 dia make a line and now go to mirror select this angle line and go to mirror line and select this center line apply now we only want this inner profile so go to trim select this outer profile and select this outer profile okay only this profile is required now we want this as a round profile so go to fillet and take a fillet of 10 select both edges here also this side both edges and this side both edges okay go to trim and trim this profile and this outer profiles and this profile okay now finish and go to extrude now you can see the profile is selected automatically go to view and change the view to shaded with edges we want a symmetric cut go to symmetric and we want to cut and drag this arrow outside so it will cut the profile okay now we want four cuts so go to 3d model and go to circular pattern select this cut profile and go to rotation axis and select this radius here the count will be of 4 and ok now we want to give the fillet radius on these edges so go to fillet take the fillet of 4 select this edge and select this edge similarly select this edge now select this edge and inner edge also we want so select this edge inner and here also inside edge okay now okay now this profile is complete you can define the color from here define its color I have taken wall paint blue to make it more realistic from here Okay, you can change the view go to view go to view style and go to shaded okay you will not able to see the edges from here you can see the view profile so this was a basic tutorial to how to make a v 
we built fully in Autodesk Inventor software. I hope you like the video. If you do that, please do hit like and subscribe the channel for more such videos. Thank you.